Hello guys, uh, today I wanna tell you how to store your crypto because it's a very very important uh, question so I have a uh, hardware wallet uh, a review a hardware wallet for you because uh, uh, it's essential to hold your crypto in a secure place so I chose uh, I, I have chosen two hardware wallets, the most popular, and the more uh, the I like to say the most reliable. So the first one is a uh, is a uh, its name is Trezor, and it's like a, uh, yeah we have here this model, and this company has a uh, like a two leading models, and depends on your needs. If you wanna like uh, hold a lot of crypto, you can choose the more uh, uh, the more developed model, like a uh, bigger, uh, and it costs like currently like 232 euros and 47 euro cent. So this is the bigger model, and you can hold not only Bitcoin but uh, a huge variety of other coins and there is also the second one like uh, a simple model and it costs uh, 65 euros ni 19 euro cent and you can hold only a few crypto on this so it depends how much uh, how how big budget you have so if you have like uh, more money to spend, I recommend this one. If you have a little bit less money, I will yeah like recommend uh, a smaller one. Yeah, you you can also see that here you have a, like a bigger display and it's like a more uh, user friendly. Here you have a little bit smaller, and yeah, both of them you can uh, connect by a wire to your laptop or a smartphone and uh, you can hold your crypto there okay the second company which uh, produce uh, hardware wallets it's a uh, ledger yeah it's a very popular company and they also have like uh, two models uh, here we have we have uh, the Ledger Nano S, so it's like a smaller one. And you have a uh, yeah a smaller display. You see here, and you can also connect by a wire. And you have like a Ledger Nano X. It's a bigger one, and you can connect by a wire. And also, it has a uh, Bluetooth. Yeah, so you can connect by a Bluetooth. So my point of view is that uh, i usually connect by a wire and i do not use bluetooth because in my in my experience it's not so secure it's better to have like a full full control over your device so it's better to avoid uh, bluetooth so it also depends uh, if you have like a bigger budget you can buy the most the uh, more advanced one but it has also more you can keep there more cryptocurrencies you know because uh, here you can keep only a few uh, because it has a limited capacity uh, so yeah it depends on your need I will recommend uh, rather the smaller one if you don't have like a lot of money <laughs> and uh, and yeah and what, what I want to uh, mention here very important in information that uh, recently like uh, not so recently but uh, like a, a year ago or something like that the ledger company has a, a problem with their website because they have a uh, breach yeah the, the the leakage of the information user information and uh, it was like a personal data from the web from their website so like uh, email uh, phone number uh, name surname stuff like that so they do not lose any 
crypto, but still those information give the uh, scammers and uh, uh, other uh, people <laughs> who, who possess those uh, data to mm, do some kind of like a mm, phishing attack and uh, other try to try to uh, like scam people you know because they know their data so it was like a huge hit in the company uh, credibility you know because they are in the industry of uh, uh, cryptography and security so if they cannot uh, hold their customer data securely it's a really big issue so <laughs> In general, I would use to recommend this company like Ledger because they have like a really nice design and good uh, quality of the product. But now I will rather recommend uh, Trezor company. So, so it depends if you have a bigger budget, you can buy a bigger one. If you have a smaller budget, you can buy a small one. And what I want to mention here that uh, in the next episode I will also mention about uh, desktop wallets because you can have a wallet on your desktop PC and uh, for example keep some uh, like other currencies, cryptocurrencies like uh, le less important and what is really important so for example a Bitcoin if you hold a lot of Bitcoin it's better to keep it here you know secure offline and you will be really happy with the service so yeah so i will make another episode and uh, i will mention about the uh, desktop uh, desktop wallets and uh, yeah here you have a like a quick review of uh, of uh, hardware wallets, offline hardware wallets. So uh, I will put in the into the description uh, uh, a referral link. So if you want to buy uh, Ledger or Trezor, you can use my referral link if you like it. If you not, <laughs> you can buy directly from their from their website. So thank you for uh, for listening, and you can watch also a second episode with the. Uh, with desktop wallets yeah bye bye